What is racking guys, welcome to another player growth test. I'll be taking a look at Will Hughes here. So definitely got quite a few requests to uh, take a look at him, so I decided to do so. Definitely uh, pretty popular in FIFA, of course, in FM. So uh, he has some great tackle stats for a young player. Passing is definitely his forte. He's a quality passer, already has great vision, short passing, like a six foot one uh, center mid, left footed, medium, medium, three star, three star. So very balanced for a central midfielder. So it's great to see. Uh, as you can see, his physical stats are very solid, you know, uh, good stamina. Stamina, balance, agility, reactions. Uh, I'm glad to see the stamina. There's always a problem with stamina for a lot of younger midfielders. I think they kind of addressed that recently, thankfully, in uh, uh, the recent updates and the like. But you'll see here, tackle sets go up at the end of the first season. Uh, great to see, of course, uh, additions to all those. Some additions to his mental stats as well. So definitely uh, looking forward to seeing how he grows over the years. He definitely is already a very quality young player. Uh, wonder kid, per se, here, as you'll see. 77 overall now at the end of year three. Uh, great ball control, dribbling, uh, short passing is looking very good long passing his vision is looking great there as well always great to see that there so hopefully continue to grow that turn into a very solid player here up to a 70 now at the 79 at the age of 25 now so again um, a lot of green there now uh, in the passing stats ball control dribble looking very good marking is improving which is great to see um if he's going to be more of a box to box type really doesn't have too much uh uh, basically orange or anything there either but now at the age of 27 he's up to his 80, uh, 83 overall which is a Sophie potential great to see it ball control dribbling look very good now long passing short passing marking is very solid as I said before and he just looks very well rounded in all his technical stats he's starting to get some more growth in physical stats as well because uh, I've had problems with his physical stats growth uh, before it was actually decreasing before and really hurting his overall so I might have to look out for that uh, it doesn't seem to grow too much physically but it's nice to see a little bit of growth in that facet of his game but you see here now he does reach uh, 84 overall at the age of 29 so again just great passing stats overall. It looks like he's going to be able to uh, basically break apart a lot of defenses uh, with those passes. Uh, and that's just great to have that type of player on your side. As you can see now, he had more growth uh, at the age of 31 here, uh, which is good to see despite dropping in some mental stats. So he just looks like a solid midfielder. Of course, midfielders do seem to grow a bit as well in this game later on, most are in their 30s. So that's something to look out for, of course. Uh, it is like that in real life. A lot of midfielders do peak in their 30s. I mean, just think of Perlo. Uh, and some other midfielders uh, of his fashion. So definitely think of that. Uh, you know, we're looking at some older players, especially in the midfield. I wouldn't be too um, basically put off by older uh, central midfielders in general because I've noticed a big trend of them actually growing, uh, you know, when they're a bit older later in, in their career. So to keep that in mind in general in FIFA career mode, uh, of course. Uh, so definitely, guys, very good player, great passer, great vision. Looks to be a solid buy for many uh, teams, you know. But uh, that'll wrap put an end to uh, my player growth test now. Thanks for tuning in, and I'll catch you guys later.